Hi guys, Ferris Preppy here. Um, I'm going to do a view today for uh, Mark, uh, aka the Dutch Knife Guy. Um, if you don't know the guy, um, obviously from the name, he does love his knives. And I mean, he's got a great collection of blades over there. Uh, anyway, he's doing a 400 subs comp, so I'm going to do an SB, uh, VR uh, for the guy. Um, he wants to know something or some things that you would never sell or get rid of for any amount of money. Um, it doesn't really have to be bushcrafty or survivalish. It can be three things that mean a lot to you personally. Um, mine is going to be on the, the bushcrafty kind of thing. Um, reason being is um, I've met a lot of really, really, really good friends in the YouTube community. And um, some of them are giving me some really awesome gifts. Um, I'll start off with uh, my first one, which is from my very, very good friend, Johnny Bushcraft. Um, and he gave me a spoon. It's the very first camp that we ever did. Um, and I actually watched the video of him day making this. Um, actually took him eight hours. It was the very first one he ever did. And um, it's awesome. You know what I mean? It's unbelievably awesome. I've never used it. Um, it actually sits in my office on my desk. Um, it's just great. I think, you know, the amount of time and effort and skill that goes into that, I mean, for his, his very first one, guys, you know, that's just absolutely amazing. Um, and as you know, Johnny's quite talented in a lot of things that he does. Um, has a great channel. He's a great guy. I know him really well. Obviously, we do a lot of camps together. Um, but yeah, that's one of the things I would never, even though it's in a little bit of wood, it means so much, I would never part with that. Um, my second thing is um, I got last year at the Wilderness Gathering. I was there with all the other guys at a good meet. And I had Sandy from Jack Law Lines come up to me. Um, totally out the blue, totally unexpected it. Um, wasn't expecting to get something like this. I mean, I, I was looking to put an order in for one. Um, and he gave me a Jack Law. Um, actually, I was gobsmacked. Um, if you go back and watch the video from the gathering, I was absolutely speechless at the time. Um, as you can see, I think it's going to pick this up. There's the sheath for it, and uh, here's the blade itself. As you can see, guys, it's a bloody stunning knife. Um, absolutely awesome. I do love it. It's my, uh, it's the only knife I use now. It's my go-to knife. Um, I wear it all the time. Every time I make uh, bushcrafting. Uh, it's just unbelievable. It's, and it's really well balanced. Now, as people who know, we know Sandy from Jack Law. Um, all his blades are awesome. I mean, um, but for Sandy to actually give me that, because um, he's actually retail for over a couple hundred pounds, and uh, for him to actually come up to me and give me that, uh, you know, it was very humbling. Um, totally out of the blue, totally unexpected. But you know, with Sandy, he's a really great guy. Um, he loves helping other people out if he can. And, uh, you know, he's just totally awesome to give me that. Um, my third thing that I would never, ever part with is from a very, very well-known guy within the community. Um, well, I reckon he is anyway. Very, very talented. Absolutely awesome guy. Um, does some outstanding work. Um, very humble guy. Um, never, ever wants anything um, if he makes you anything. You know, he's one of them guys who who just likes to give all the time. Um, and that person is uh, Andy from Stony Boat Bushcraft. Um, I went to the Bushcraft show last year. Um, the story behind it is uh, Andy uh, won my competition. Um, I think it was my 250 sub giveaway or my 100 sub giveaway, I can't remember now. And um, basically he won the ticket for the Bushcraft show and 100 pounds spending money. Um, so yeah, seen Sandy there, I've set up a tent, uh, seen Andy there, set up a tent, shaking me across, he said, FP, I've got a gift for you. Um, I was quite busy doing my tent, trying to get everything ready, because you know, it's been a rush to get in there. I said, yeah, okay, I'm just put it there, mate, and I'll have a look at a minute. Anyway, goes and unpacks it, when I had a bit of time, and what he gave me was a hand-carved staff. Now, the detail in this, guys, and the time it must have taken... It was absolutely awesome, and the bit I loved the most as well was he actually put my name 
in there. Um, I'll just show you the full length of it, guys. Um, you know, it's just absolutely out of this world. As you can see, it's got his little name on there as well, Stony Broke. Um, but I said the carving itself, I don't know if you can see that, guys, you know. Now, when I'm doing a lot of hikes and walks now, I do take this as long as I remember to. Um, but it's just, I've just blown me away, you know. It's, uh, it's one of those things I'll never ever part with, um, no matter what, you know. We, it's personal to me, it's even personalised it um, to me, you know. This was just an absolutely stunning gift from somebody who didn't have to. Um, you know, I've been on a few camps with Andy. Um, he came to the uh, forest meet, like myself and the rest of the Camp Shaky Boys organised at Christmas. Uh, you know, he's a top guy, very knowledgeable, always willing to help others out, you know. But yeah, that's the three things that I would never part with. Um, they're just totally, you know, totally awesome, really. Um, sorry if I'm off camera a minute, guys. I'll just take you off and I'll get you have a, let you have an overview of that. I hope this is okay for your competition, Mark. Um, I have chucked a Jack Law blade in there, obviously, and the spoon from Johnny Bushcraft, and obviously my, my staff that I was kindly given from Stony Broke. You know, absolutely stunning. Hey guys, I'm going to leave it there. Um, if you don't know Mark, uh, Dutch United guy, please go and check out his channel. I will put a link below, um, just in case all you guys who don't know him. I'll put a link below on my channel, just you can go check him out. He is a great guy. He comments a lot on loads of people's channels. Um, a real, real great part of this community. He's another guy who sends a lot of gifts all over the world um, and never expects anything in return. So guys, if you don't know uh, Mark from, uh, from the Dutch Knife Guy, please go and check him out. Okay guys, that's it. Like before, uh, stay prepped and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.